Hello everyone, welcome back to Slides to Coasters. Yeah, I know, it's been a while. Um, let's kind of talk about it for a minute. So, uh, it's August now. It is uh, one of my favorite months of the year. And uh, we're finally back at it yet again, talking about theme parks, water parks, and holiday events. Um, you know, there's no good way of saying it. It's just been a very busy summer for me. Uh, I've had a lot of things pop up over the past few months to where I just simply put have not been able to go and produce content, uh, especially considering the fact that, you know, Hollywood Nights happened, which originally that was going to be a large series for me. I was going to do a little bit of a, uh, I was going to do a lot of content throughout Hollywood Nights, but there's a thing that happened there that I'm not going to really talk about. Um, and out of respect for the whole entire situation, I'm deciding not to even talk about it this year. Um, which that's going to be a conversation for a future discussion about the grander concept of coaster events. Uh, because I think that we really need to have a dialogue about that, especially as we move forward as a coaster community. Um, let's kind of briefly talk about where the channel's at. Uh, our Instagram has been exploding. Uh, we've been having a lot of uh, record numbers of Instagram followers, which I am greatly appreciative of. But for us, the Slides of Coasters as a YouTube channel, uh, you know, I've been kind of dialing it back a little bit. Um, we are going to be changing up content from here on out, and there's a good reason why. And we're going to kind of dial into those conversations as we're going through this Um so, let's first talk about the podcast. What exactly is going to happen with the podcast? Uh, the Slides to Coasters podcast will still happen. Uh, that's still going to be something that we do. That's still going to be a uh, big thing for me is to keep on continuing on with the uh, podcast concept. But we're not going to sit there and continually do podcasts week after week after week after week. Why do I say that? Uh, we simply put, uh, let me, prime example, uh, just scrolling through here. The last uh, podcast we did was 17 views, uh, a, another one, 34, 50 views, 7 views. Uh, the larger, longer content that we put up gets less views than our smaller content. So, in reflection to that, and then plus considering the fact that I really don't want to do solo podcasts anymore, um, I enjoyed a podcast concept uh, as I had it. A lot of people enjoyed the conversations, the dialogue, the diatribes, the extended uh, jokes that I did. But when it comes to the numbers, when it comes to the values, we as a channel, especially as a conglomerate, as we're moving forward now, I really want to go and hone in on smaller, shorter segments. Uh, so content, we're still going to have the Slice of Coasters podcast. And in fact, we're changing it up to where it's going to be a uh, co-host and or a tri-host to where it's kind of hanging out. We're kind of talking about stuff. Uh, it's not going to be 100% coasters. Um, and, and that's something that I really want to kind of stress is that Slides to Coaster is going to be expanding its horizons over the next year, especially when it comes to content like, you know, talk about gaming, talk about other things that I think are kind of cool and that I think are really important. Uh, we're just going to be moving and growing in that direction, in a positive direction, because I believe that we as an organization can do it. Um, you know, we're going to be producing podcasts probably every week or every other week. Um, you know, do not be surprised if podcasts kind of go a little more to the side as we branch into more shorter content. And that's a hundred percent reflected by the fact that a lot of the content that we're putting out for the next few weeks is going to be shorter. Um, you know, I've got shows lined up for this week. I got shows lined up for next week and the week thereafter. To where, yeah, we're going to have content that's coming out. Yeah, it's going to be uh, this mindful discussion, but it's not going to be like the hour-long, 45-minute-long uh, podcast. We're still going to produce them, sure, but it's not going to be as long. It's not going to be as grandois. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to be doing 10- to 15-minute shows, you know, shorter shows about theme parks, uh, theme park events, theme park news. Um, I'm going to be having a few reviews over the next few weeks too, just kind of rounding out the summer 
and just kind of talking about, you know, my thoughts on a lot of the things that have happened over the past uh, season. There's a lot. There is a lot to unpack, especially considering the fact that this was not a good year uh, for myself, at least for theme parking. It just hasn't. You know, I've been to what? I've been to Holiday World, Cedar Point, Kings Island. Uh, you know, I've done a few things here and there, but otherwise, for the most part, for the Grand Wild staying, those are my major trips. And that bugs me a lot because I want to go and I want to do a lot more this fall. Uh, it's not looking like it, but I would love to. You know, 2021, 2020, really, this year span was supposed to be when I was supposed to get 300 coaster credits. I'm currently sitting at 240. Um, the trips that I planned, the trips that I wanted to do, simply put, have not happened, will not happen this year. I uh, would be surprised if they happen next year. With that in mind, we are still going to do content. We're still going to do stuff. And in fact, next year, you know, we're probably going to start doing vlogs and that kind of stuff. So be on the lookout for that. And really just kind of expanding our horizons because I do believe that we can do it. I believe that if any channel can do it, Slice of Coasters can do it. Um, and just moving forward. You know, we're going to be producing a lot more shorter content. You know, we're going to be producing a lot more uh, random content. Just because I think that we really want to go and explore other concepts that we don't really talk about that very often. So, we're going to be exploring concepts like, you know, restaurant reviews. We're going to be exploring things like, you know, foodie reviews in general. We're actually going to be doing uh, on-the-scene recording, that kind of stuff. Really trying to explore that, and as well, having conversations about the future of parks, um, you know, fin finalizing some of the series that we need to kind of wrap up, and just other things I think that we as an organization do well at uh, in comparison to other channels. And just kind of on that note, you know, Slides to Coasters is not a big organization, you know, it's a one man band. Uh, you know, I got a few people that I can rely on for a few things, but otherwise this is it. This is the whole entire organization. And I'm really looking forward to expanding our horizons in forms of creativity. Uh, especially as we go into this new year, we're going to have a lot more content, a lot more things to do. Uh, do not be alarmed uh, if 2022 becomes a massive year for us because I think we're going to do a lot more next year. We got the capacity to do things like go on over to these major theme parks again, uh, do walking tours, do vlogs, that kind of stuff. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this update. Again, uh, this week in particular, we're probably going to be having uh, uploads from today, tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Take the weekend off. But after that, the normal routine is going to be probably Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And or Monday, Friday. Uh, that's when we're going to be producing a lot of our content. That's a way for you to come on into a week with a brand new uh, show. Kind of talk about what's going on. And then Friday, uh, leaving you out for the weekend to go and listen to something. Maybe while you're working out. Or maybe uh, on Saturday morning as you're eating breakfast or whatever. Uh, so with that being said, stay tropical guys. And we'll see you guys next time.